All right, guys, what's up? This is week three of the second season with the Citadel. Today, we've got Georgia Southern, and this is a road game, first conference game of the season. They're ranked number 25, so this is our second top 25 game of the season so far, and they're they're pretty much, they're slightly better than us, except for defense. Uh, they're C minus, we're D plus, their offense is much better. Uh, let's take a look at their schedule real quick, just to see who they've already who they've already won against. Um, FIU. Well, they they really won that game, and they're a C. FIU is a C plus. Goodness. Uh, let's take a look at their roster. Uh, we played them really early last last year, so I don't really remember. I don't even remember this guy, man. He's a sophomore and he's an 84. Yeah, I do. I mean, I remember they have scramblers. Like they're all their quarterbacks all have good speed, and they're they're they have good depth at quarterback. That guy's an eighty four overall. He's got eighty throw accuracy. Man, he's only five six. I just realized that. <laughs> um, Ken Johnson. Yeah, this is they're gonna be. They actually have pretty good receivers too, man. They, this team's pretty good. Um, they have a lot of talent at the skill positions. Their O line is looks like their tackles are solid. Their guards are everybody's seventy two to sixty eight. Uh, we gotta watch that defensive end. Uh, linebackers aren't great, so yeah, we have. A, uh, I think we can take advantage of their linebackers. This corner is looks pretty good. Safety's not great. So like I said, their deep, their offense is their strong. Is their strength. Um, so I'm hoping we can take advantage and be able to run the ball pretty well. Uh, we'll see though. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about it. It's I mean it's their first conference game of the season. This is a big one. Uh, we got a tough stretch here. We got at Georgia Southern, then we got to go at Furman, and they're two and zero already. Well, look at Wofford. Wofford's three and zero. Okay. I think I don't even know if Wofford won a game last year, and they're three and zero now. So. All right. So. We're number 26. <laughs> this is so close to being a top 25 matchup. That would be the first. If we win this game, we'll be ranked for the first time in this dynasty. And we'd be going on a. Well, we'd be winding the bowl game, so we could be going on a four game win streak here. But we got to get through this. So. Along with two of the best commentators in the game, Kirk Herbstreet and Lee Corso. Looks like a pretty day there. So last year, this is okay. Statesboro, Georgia. Statesboro, Georgia. That's right. So we played them at home last year. Uh, so we got to go at their place. The season's just begun, and these two SEC East teams are ready to do battle. And here I do like their uniforms. They're simple, but they're cool. Just solid colors. I like our uniforms better though. <laughs> All right, this guy, we got to watch him. He's only a sophomore, goodness. They've got some, uh, they're going to be good for the next few years. Their quarterback's a sophomore. I think their running back was a, what was their running back in junior? Oh, look at this. So Kirk picked Georgia Southern. Lee is picking us. Interesting. They don't do that very often. Usually they kind of agree with one side. We'll see. I hope Lee's right. We'll see. All right, they're going to... Okay, they receive. Good. I would like to kick. Especially on the road, I want to kick and hopefully get a stop. And then we can uh, not give up too much momentum. Oh, they're already doing stuff. What are they doing? <laughs> I tried that little return reverse play. It didn't work, though. I love the night games. I love night games in uh, in this uh, NCAA 07. They look so good under the lights. Today we get to watch a it's kind of like a, a late evening kickoff. Right so we're going to go man again. I mean, we did this. I remember playing again the, uh, against them the first time, and we did a lot of mad defense. They come out throwing. All right. So Georgia Southern, this is going to be one of the hardest offenses to stop because they they run the triple option and they're built to run it. Um, their quarterback's really fast. Their running backs are good. Fullback is good. So this formation here, they could literally go either way. I'm just playing uh, safety spy with Edwards, and they're going to go left. So there we go. There's Robinson making the play, so our defense is much better, guys. And 
if you've watched the last two games, we 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 we'll, I'll tell you what, Alcorn State, we uh we gave up a lot of passing yards. They hit a lot of big plays, but we played pretty well the first game of the season. Um, so this will be interesting to see if our run defense can hold up against Georgia Southern here. Oh, they're trying this reverse. Oh, my goodness, and it worked. They got a few yards out of it. I don't know why that play. I don't know if it's a. I don't think that play is supposed to be like a like a read. I think they. I think the quarterback's supposed to hand it off to the running back. But maybe I'm wrong. Maybe not. That's such a long play to develop. I feel like that's why. That's why I never run that play. All right, they got their running back in the slot over there. We gotta watch him. Going deep. No. Man, you can't defend that animation when they get that. Uh, I mean, we, that route wasn't even that great. Like he, Jackson played that really well, but oh, you can't defend that when they make that catch. All right, um, I'm gonna spy with Atkins. We'll kind of play play the ball with Edwards here. That's a handoff. There we go. We're there. Guys coming in, averaging 100 yards, 110 yards per game. This may be a pretty quick game because we're both going to run the ball a lot and use up clock. Unless we give up a bunch of big plays. <laughs> I mean, let's hope we don't. I'm going to send Robinson. Oh, he overran it. Oh, no. No. Damn it. I sent Robinson on the blitz, and he was right there. Watch, I don't know if y'all... Oh, uh, yeah, he... I didn't, actually, I didn't mean to skip that, but he was... Uh, I sent him on the blitz, but he... Just ran right in between and took himself out of the play. That was unfortunate. Oh, he blocked one. <laughs> Let's go. Finally. I'm sorry, that's cheesy, guys. I just wanted to see if I could get one blocked. There we go. As Nicholas coming in, overload the right side, and that just sends a free rusher sometimes. <laughs> All right. We're playing on Heisman. I wouldn't do that if we were playing on, if we weren't playing on Heisman. But oh, we have a return up. No, can't get that. Can't get a block there. Okay, so they got a touchdown, but they only went, that block kick actually saved some momentum. So, or at least I think it did. All right, we gotta watch this. Number 55 over there. They're in, are they in 5-2 already? Yeah, they're going to be playing run a lot. I don't know what they're in. I, I mean, they're in 5-2, right? Yeah, they're just in man. Wow. I thought they jumped. Look at this guy. Oh, they, 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 look, they look pretty solid on defense. That guy was all... He was all over the ball. I mean, immediately he started running to where the option was going. Now what are they in? Dime? The Eagle. Line up with six defensive backs. I don't mind when people run dime against this because we can go up the middle or we can take it out and just pick up some yards with Townsend. It's not bad. Alright, third and four. I'm going to no huddle it since they're in dime. Get them out of formation here. See, they're going to audible. Yeah, they're in 5-2 now, but they've got probably linebackers and corners maybe. No, probably just linebackers and on the... Uh, Defensive line there, and we got took advantage of that. Here we go. Let's go, McIntyre. Good run. Anytime they come out and dime like that, I'm gonna I I'm, I'm gonna probably no huddle at least one play, unless we need to choose a different play. Just because when they come out and dime, and then they if they they either have to run the same formation or they got guys out of place if they audible. Oh, nowhere to go. Mm. Now, there's nowhere to go. I tried to bounce it outside, but lost two yards. Man. Okay. We're good. I want to try to avoid those negative rushes, though, as much as I can. It's not going to be easy because they've got talent. That number 55 is going to be a problem. Their linebackers aren't great, but the rest of their defensive line is pretty solid. Early jump. Did we get that? 
I don't know if it's gonna. Well, oh, it may not matter. We're good. Turn the corner. Ah, couldn't break it. He's knocked out of bounds at the 44 yard. What do I do here? Looked like it jumped early. Where was he at? Is it third and one? I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take the 10 yards. There, I feel like I can get this third and two. I mean, second and seven, there's no guarantee I pick up five yards. It may be like third and five, so. Maybe I'll run this up the middle. We'll see. Or on the edge here, I don't know. Or with, oh. What happened? <laughs> what? They called that an incomplete pass. <laughs> I tried to I tried to throw a lateral. I, well, we may go for it here. What do you guys think? Hey, at least try to draw them off sides. They're in that five two again. Can we get this? I think we can. Oh, look at that. Let's go. No, no, damn it. That's okay. Come on, Jackson. You're all right. That was a that was a little bit of a ballsy call there. I. Uh, I wasn't sure if that was going to work, to be honest. <laughs> I just didn't want to hesitate. I didn't want to think about it. I wanted to just call the play and, and run it, and it worked. So, Man, okay, here we go. Bounce around to back to the inside. Not bad. Five yards. We'll go to under... We're going to shotgun now. Uh, let's try this. Uh, I need to keep running some more plays. Actually, you know what? Let's stick to what's working, actually. I'm going to go uh, just hand off here. I was going to do shotgun, but we, we're, mo we're moving the ball. I don't want to get crazy. If they start overloading the run a lot, like they're in man here. They're matching up. There comes a blitz. Oh, no. We can't have McIntyre fumbling the ball. He had he fumbled quite a bit last year, but considering the amount of carries he gets, it's not too bad. But yeah, we can't get we cannot turn the ball over in this game. This is This is a game that we cannot let get out of hand. Because they're going to run the ball, they're going to take up time. It's going to be harder to force fumbles when they run. Okay. Offsides, we got the first down. Nice. So again, I am I'm recording this ahead of time, uh, not ahead of time, but like I, I haven't uploaded, I haven't uploaded either of the first two games of the season yet on YouTube. So this one, um, I'm recording this the very next day. So my plan is to just try to get as many of these done while I can. Oh, here we go, McIntyre's open. Can we get a block? Try to get the first down. That'll work. They were in man-to-man -man coverage on that play, and I couldn't tell if the defender slipped. So it's Saturday now. It's uh, it's pretty early, actually. Well, it's not early. It's at, it's right at noon. It's, uh, it's a pretty rainy day here in Charleston, so it's a good time to, to play some football. All right, we're in the red zone. Oh, look at that. That guy's blocking him. Nice. Did y'all see that? We only got a yard, but look at 70, number 70 was pushing that guy back. Nice. Okay, I like I like to see that. I like to see our line get pushed. Because it seems like, it seems like every other time they're getting thrown backwards, so. All right, let's go, let's try, yeah, let's try the uh, spread here and shotgun. Try that again. It worked for that one play, but this is just going to be a run all the way. No, nowhere to go. We didn't get the edge. Damn it. Mm, okay. What are we at here? Third and twelve. I can play for the field goal. I tell you what, the we ran this play last season against them. I feel like, or maybe that was previewing him. I'm going to look at Haston. If he's not open, I'll probably just run or throw it away. Or hit McIntyre. Haston. No! What? Oh, how did we threw it at that guy? Come on. I thought he had it. I thought Haston was going to get that. 
That was actually not a bad throw. He could have thrown it more to the outside. Look at that. I thought he was going to get it. Oh, come on. Damn it. Okay. I threw it because he was in one-on-one. -on -one. He was in a one-on-one -on -one matchup, and if I thought he was going to be able to, to jump up and grab that. Oh, nice. Who was that? Oh, we sent, yeah. That was Atkins. Good awareness, Atkins. All right. I think we can stop their run. I'm not... I mean, I'm a little worried about it, but I think we can stop their run. It's just as long as they don't do a bunch of play action and throw it deep downfield on us. That's a direct snap. Uh-oh, we're not there. Come on. Just like that, they get, what, 11 yards? Okay, big third down here. Um, it's a chance to get off the field three and out after that interception. I mean, I've got to call blitzes. I, I I don't like calling blitzes that much, but I trust our I trust our secondary. I know we got beat up last game, but well, I mean, look at this. We've got to play the run. No, ah. that's just that's so hard to defend. I mean, we were there, but if he if that was just a handoff to the fullback, we were gonna stop it. But that was a good call. It's first down. All right, they're just in a standard eye here. Tight formation. Call on something audible here. That's a handoff to the fullback. Oh, good tackle. Oh, goodness. He broke that first one, had some space. And that guy's not, that guy's not slow either. He's solid. He could run for it. He could run for some yards. <laughs> it's called the same play, Thunder Green. Especially when they, I mean, what else am I going to call when they come out in this formation? They're passing it, though. Where's he going? Pick it off. Let's go. Let's go, Travis Payne. That's his second of the season. Did we get pressure on the QB, or is that just a bad throw? I think it was a bad throw. Yeah, he, well, I don't know. I think, they, I think their wide receiver kind of stopped his route. So I don't know who was, I don't know who that was on, but we'll take it. <laughs> nice. All right. We moved the ball last time. We just threw a stupid pick in the end zone. That's okay, though. I got to be aggressive. I mean, I want to. I would have liked to take the field. Oh, goodness. I almost got hit the backfield. McIntyre able to get some yards out of it. Six yards. Nice. So, I, uh, I, I would have loved to take the field goal there on that last drive, but I've got to be aggressive. I mean, I can't. This is not a game where I can just take field goals and play conservative on offense. I've got to I've got to step up and match them because they've already got one touchdown on me. I may not snap this. We'll see if they jump. Now they're not going to. Okay. All right. In the first quarter. Let's try to score here though. We we got second and 4 on the 43-yard line. Let's pick up this first down. See, this is the defense I don't like when they're in this 3-3. This 3-3-5 defense here, the bear formation, I think is what it's called. Oh, break it. Let's go. Let's go, Washington. Nice. Good run. We need this guy. He's he's a, yeah, offsides. He's a four-star recruit, but he's a 78 overall, which is really good. Um, I mean, well... I think most four stars are average to be 76, so he's on the high end of a four star recruit. I think I've said, I think I've talked about this before, but so like basically, five star recruits tend to be 80 overall. Four stars are 76. Three stars are around 72. Two stars are around like 68 or 65, and then one stars are like sometimes below 60. Um, and it depends, you know. That's just like the average. Cut back in. Ah, oh, I was trying to get. Hit. I was trying to throw a block there. Get mad. Washington to throw a block. Let's do no huddle again. I like this formation there. Um. Okay. I just hold up the middle. Let's go, McIntyre. That was a fantastic touchdown run 
I saw that hole open up and I just had to cut back, run right up the middle. Yeah, look at that. That was such a big hole. Let's go. And he broke a tackle there. All right, we're about to take the lead if we don't get this blocked. I tell you what, guys, I was so worried about this game because I, mean, I still am. <laughs> it's, not, it's, it's pretty early. Um, I'm worried about this game because it's the first conference game of the season. I don't, I don't want to start with the loss, but this is also... There's a chance. I think Western Carolina is still the team to beat, but... I mean, we were predicted to finish below this, below Georgia Southern, so I just didn't want to lose this game because, you know, if they were to only, I mean, here's the deal. If they lose this, if we lose this game, then Georgia Southern is going to have to lose two conference games in order for us to win the East because even if we only, if we, if we win out, they will hold a tiebreaker even if they only lose one more game, so I don't know what the hell that play is. Fake handoff to everyone, and then he picks up. No, he didn't get any yards. Okay. All right, let's let's keep to the run. I mean, if they if they beat us through the air, then that's good for them. But I've got to stay. I've got to. I mean, I can't just rush forward and drop back into zone coverage. I've got to. We're doing that right now, but I'm gonna spy with Edwards, and I'll probably watch this running back over here. Here we go. Yep. Nice. Good play. I feel like our our guys have pretty good awareness. They're they that was his own coverage, but they're they're ready for the run. Like he was right there on the line of scrimmage to make that tackle. Sometimes when, I'm gonna call a zone here, be pretty conservative, put Robinson over on that side. Yeah, they're throwing. Oh, nice! I thought that was gonna be caught, but. He kind of, that was a good pass, but he kind of forced it in between several defenders, so. Yeah, what I'm saying is, like, sometimes when you call zone defense and your guys just, like, they'll just kind of, like, fall back into coverage and end up giving up, like, you know, the running back will get, like, five yards before they even get there to make a tackle. Oh, no. Somebody get it. No. Damn it. I guess that's why I call fair catch, guys. <laughs> that right there is why I call fair catch. It's not worth picking up eight yards if you're going to fumble. Damn it. I don't know what I was thinking. I usually call fair catch on this. All right, that's okay. We need Fox. He's been solid for us. That was a good tackle. We can't, we, it's two turnovers already. We can't be turning it over like this. That's one thing I didn't want to. I was worried about trying to move the ball on offense. I mean, I was worried about every every phase of this game. I was worried about stopping them on defense, moving the ball on offense. But then we can't turnovers are just we can't do that. <laughs> All right, so third and four on the thirty-six. This is a big play here. I think I'm going to stick with this zone blitz. But I'm going to I'm going to hold the edge here with Edwards. They may be running right. No, they're going to throw it. Okay. No, it's a draw. Oh, no, we're not there. No. Wow, Edwards got a big hit on him. That guy's quick. He's so small. He was, I think he's 5'6". I, if I, I scrolled over that really quickly. I guess I could have gone back. But I think he's 5'6". <laughs> that's such a that's the smallest quarterback. That's the smallest quarterback I've ever seen. Yeah, he, he doesn't look that tall, that's for sure. That's an option pass. No. I don't. What happened there? I, I, Payne. I think he was just not in the right position. Oh yeah, he had inside position, and then I tried to take control of him, but I overran it. Try to tack on the extra point. Now the thing about that one is it wasn't even like that throw was not that great, but where he put the ball ended up working out perfectly. Because it, what was what was going to happen is their receiver would have either boxed out Payne to make the catch, or I would have had to I, I did what the other option was try to run around him and then cut him back off on the inside. 
but the pass was a little bit behind the guy, made him slow down, and that was, that was easy catch. All right, 7-13, they got plus four momentum now, so we gotta be careful here. Do they, what defense are they running? This is 3-4. I have no idea, I thought they run 3-3-5 too, but maybe not. Oh, we got held up. Watch out for that guy. Oh, he didn't tackle him. <laughs> I'm not sure how their dot defensive end didn't tackle Townsend. I threw the pitch when he was right next to us. That was weird. Well, the good thing is we were able to move the ball on offense. I was a little worried. I was a little worried their defense would come out playing and hitting us in the backfield. This is a road SEC get out like that. There we go. Although that was just a blitz. That wasn't really... I mean, that guy got flattened over there. <laughs> All right, third and five. McIntyre in the zone. We probably just need to get him the ball. I'm going to call option run to the right. Oh, here's the 3-3-5. Three, three, and they don't have their dot guy on. Okay, this this uh, they shift right, but I'm okay with that. They're in man coverage on the, on the wide receivers. Yeah, it takes the DBs out of the play, so we got, yeah, we're good now. Oh, good run. So on that, I think on that play, all the receivers just, they don't block, they just run. They streak on go routes down the field. And then when they're in man coverage, the the DBs just kind of just hang with them and follow them. All right, now they're in, they're in zone now, but they're also in that 3-3-5, so... Gotta be careful here. I think this is. I think this will work if we can hold the edge here. Oh, just barely. Look at Washington downfield. <laughs> he's trying to throw the block. Now he's running out of bounds. <laughs> Where are you going, man? <laughs> Marcelo Washington was downfield trying to throw a block. He got a little chip block, but then he just kept running to the sideline. <laughs> it's kind of funny. All right, 55 is back in the game, and he's of course on the side. No, I forgot I called this play. I don't. I didn't mean to call that play. <laughs> it's okay though. It'll take it. Oh no! Ooh, good. Wow. Look at McIntyre coming in clutch. That's about as ugly as an option can look. Well, it certainly wasn't pretty, that's for sure. But like Brad said, about as ugly as an option can look. You know how many times I've heard that running triple option? I mean, it's so hard to. I mean, I'll probably fumble it one out of, you know, out of a hundred plays, I probably fumble it four times on the triple option, if not more. Oh, I couldn't get to the edge. I got destroyed. My goodness. I got stuck on my offensive lineman. I was trying to get to the edge, and then that guy just destroyed me. All right, we got to try. We got to be. We got to stay aggressive. We got to try a pass here. If it's not there, I can't force it. But this is third and 12. I don't really want to go for it unless I pick this up. Oh, we got it. What a throw. What? What is this? We've got a flag down on the field. Might have been offside. Did they jump? I didn't even see it. Offside. Okay, they jumped. I, I honestly didn't even see that. I was doing the snap count, but I didn't even pay attention to them jumping, so. Alright, let's stay in the spread. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the thirty yard. Alright, I I like this. Fifty fives on the right side. Georgia Southern comes out defensively. And they shift in. Okay. I got two guys following though. Yeah, that guy's blitzing, but Matt, they leave McIntyre wide open. Oh, got him with the jaw. Oh, if I could have scored there. I got him with the back juke, the step back. Oh, that was awesome. All right, first and goal on the two. And they're not going to call a timeout, so we can take this down. It's unless we score on the first play here, we can take this down pretty well. Not going to be in a hurry. I would like to have a halftime lead. That would be nice. And we get the ball first. Okay, that's fine. That's okay, actually. 
That's going to run more clock, so I'm okay with that. I'm going to no huddle it, though. Just keep him in that same... Uh, what is this guy doing? <laughs> what the hell is he doing? <laughs> it's just going back and forth. All right, I got to call this play to the... Uh, I'm just going to keep audible and see if they can get him. Oh, they can't hear me now. Come on. Come on. You're good. I got to call timeout. Washington wasn't... I don't know why he couldn't hear me there at the end. That was weird. We got. We still got two timeouts. We're good. Um, all right. <sighs> Which formation do I want? I think I'm going to stick with this and get the receivers over there on the left side. Just to see if we can spread them out a little bit. Okay. Well, I don't know if it's, oh, let's just try it. Early jump. Oh, no. I wasn't ready. I may still hand this off. No, there wasn't any space. That was risky. Oh, my goodness. Okay, we got to be careful here. McIntyre in the zone. I'm probably just going to hand it off. Let's get him in the, in the fullback role. And, again, they're not calling timeout, so... I can take this down pretty... Oh, 55's not in the game. Okay. Uh, this is probably going to be a handoff with... Oh, man, they they look like they're stuff in the middle here. But he's in the zone. If he can just break one tackle. Come on, McIntyre. There's space. No! What? How did he not get in? Are I going to call a flag on that? No. How did he not get in? I swear. Okay. Uh, we gotta go for this. Uh, he's uh, okay. Come on, we can do this. Just power it in, Townsend. Gotta be careful here. The left side. Oh my no! What? He got he got the hit on me. He pushed me back. Come on. All he had to do was not get not get pushed back and just fall forward a little bit. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I don't think he got in there. And I can't challenge it. I forgot. Yeah, you can't challenge under two minutes. So can we get a safety here? Oh, almost. I'm going to call timeout and make him one, one more play here. I, I mean, if, if they if they get a 99-9 run on me, then I will, I will just forfeit the game. <laughs> All right. I think... I mean, they're probably just going to hand it off to the fullback here. Or Johnson in the backfield, but let's just send blitzes. Oh my gosh. That was closer than I was wanting that to be. If Reed doesn't make that ankle tackle, he's that's a touchdown. He's still running. Okay. Um, not the way we wanted to end that half. Do we have any, well, we had two turnovers and then turned it over on that on the downs play there on, in the goal line. Red zone is not good. We're one we're one for three in the red zone. That's really bad. Um, two turnovers. But you know what? We're okay. We get the ball first. We're actually outgaining them on offense, which is surprising. I was not expecting that. McIntyre's already got 80 yards. He's got 14 carries, though. i got to watch him. I can't run him too much. I don't want to give him more, much more than 20 carries. So I really, I mean, he may get up to like 25 this game, but I got to be careful. I got to get uh, Marcelo Washington more involved. All right. And we're just about set to get things underway here in the second half. The second half. He kicks off. All right, let's go, Haston. Can we get a return here? He's in the zone. Nope, that's okay. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another. All right, so we're moving the ball okay. Give me one second because um, Jackson's not in the game, or right, Jackson got hurt, so I'm gonna put Haston in on this in this formation. Um, I like running the I like running the ball with Haston. I like getting him involved on the ground. Because we, we don't throw it very much at all, obviously. Okay, I gotta run this the other way. I know McIntyre's in the zone, actually, so this works out. I didn't even notice that. But I wanna go away from their defensive end anyway. Oh, wow, that was almost a forward pass. Oh, look at the move. He's gone. 
All right. What a start. Okay. 76 yard touchdown run. I'm going I'm probably going to sit him the next series. I don't want to overrun him, but that right there is why we need him. Look at this move. Ooh. Got him on the soft juke. What a play. That was huge. I was just about to say how we need to like have a good drive here. We can take up some clock and hopefully get a touchdown, but I, I will take that. I'll take a play. I'll take a touchdown on the first play. That was nice. I don't know. Was that that was almost a forward pass? So that could have been a seventy-six yard touchdown pass. But I'll take <laughs> I'll take the rushing yards for McIntyre. That's eighty plus seventy-six now. Somebody do the math on that. One fifty-six. Is that right? That's not right. No, that's right. Eighty plus eighty is one sixty. Yeah. One hundred fifty-six rushing yards for McIntyre. Don't give. Okay, good tackle. All right, momentum. We momentum is actually pretty even. We I think we have like a slight tick on our side. Uh, maybe not. It looks like we do. There's like a very, very, like very slight little tick of momentum towards the Citadel over there. But they're coming out shotgun. They're throwing. Their quarterback's not very accurate right now. Yeah, they're probably gonna. They need to stick to running. But I'm I'm ready for the run. I'm not gonna play too aggressive here. Let's uh, let's blitz Robinson, but we're gonna spy basically with Edwards. I'm gonna watch. I gotta. If they throw a pass, I gotta watch 48. But it's a run up the middle, and we're there. Third and ten. Here we go. Can we get off the field here? Uh, what if I wanna call the? I mean, we gotta call the. Uh, I'm gonna spy with Robinson on the right. I'm kind of gonna put him in the middle here, just because I gotta watch the quarterback run. It's not worth blitzing four people. Oh, that's why we do it. He almost got the pick. Oh man. He did try to force that one. Oh my goodness, that would have been huge. Robinson, he's he's been solid, but he's not had the the big plays yet. That's okay. I mean, he's. He's an 82 overall. He's a Juco recruit. He's still learning, just like all these other guys. All right, I got to call. I'm not doing that. I'm calling fair catch. <laughs> I'm not fumbling again on the kickoff or on the punt return. All right, let me get um, – let me see here. Yeah, let me run with Washington just for a few plays at least. Actually, what do I want to do here? Let me run. I'm going to run this. I'm going to just leave uh, McIntyre to block. Although he's on the left side again. Oh my goodness. Or the right side. It'll be fine. I'm not scared of him. We got the early jump anyway. Oh, look at this. Just gotta watch this. Okay, that's fine. I'll probably take the yards here. That's what, eight or nine yards? Made a nine yard run. Eight yard run. Uh, yeah. I gotta take eight yards, second and two. If it were third and two, maybe that'd be a little different, but. All right, let's, uh, I'm probably gonna hand this off with, to uh, Washington here. But, you know what, it's okay. McIntyre, he, it was only one big run. He's he's still pretty rested, but there we go. We got space, nice. I mean, here's the thing. I, I said I was gonna sit McIntyre for a series, but. If I can score here and then put the pressure on their offense, I mean, I'm, I I want to be aggressive, so I don't want to, I don't want to get like a, you know, I don't want to get a three and out or, yeah, let's just stay with it. I'm gonna keep it though. All right, come on, we we're good, we're fine. McIntyre, he's fine, he's he's rested up. We just came out of the halftime and he had one big run. I gotta stick with the hot hand. I just gotta be careful here. They're not moving at all. They didn't get a great jump though. Look at this. Gotta stay with the hot hand. And he's all the way down to the 31. We were watching him in practice, and let me tell you, I don't know how many. What McIntyre is having a game. Against the first team defense and you know he was he was fine the first two games he did what he he did what was expected but here's where he's really showing out I don't even know how many rushing yards he's gonna get close to 200 probably if not over 
Uh, let's put... Um, I think this is my four-string halfback. <laughs> Number 32. I think this is my one of my athlete recruits. Um, so I'm, not, I'm just going to block with him. Smith, uh, he plays corner, but I think he... Oh, look at that. They're jumping now. So, yeah. Um, I don't remember if I put that in the depth chart. I may have adjusted that in in between uh, in between games, but let's just let's just hand it off here. It's first and five. Um, so yeah, anyway, number thirty-two. He's a cornerback on the depth chart, but he's actually not he's not bad as a running back. So I, I put him in as four-string running back just because he has good speed. Well, actually, he's only. Yeah, he's four string running back because Jackson lines up at fullback and then number thirty four, James, is technically the third string running back, I think. But we need running backs. I mean you you need three running backs in a triple option like this. I mean right now we're running Haston at wide receiver, but he's basically you know, this is basically him playing running back. Alright, here we go. Second and three. There's some space. Oh, I threw a bad pitch. I was scared if he hit me that I wouldn't get the, the lateral off. Let's run it again, though. Let's run it back. I might flip it with Haston, though. Or I may go up the middle. Can I go up the middle here? I don't think so. It looks pretty... Oh, there we go. <laughs> They're jumping. We got him jumping. Well, that was big. I really didn't want to kick a field goal here. I mean... I guess, I mean, a field goal is still fine, actually, but if I can get a touchdown here, you make it put some real pressure on their offense. Okay, yeah, three, three, uh, one for three in the red zone. That's not good. Let's not do that. Let's make it two for four. Come on, Washington, let's go. Good break tackle. Five yards, not bad. Okay, this, if I can cut up the middle and find a hole here, this may work. Alright, first down. 192 yards, look at that. He's got 18 carries already, but look, he's in the zone, I gotta get him the ball. I mean... As long as they block He's got two touchdowns already. It's first and goal. Ball on the seven. This impact tailback would love nothing more than to have the ball in his hands right now. They're actually not stacking the box. This may work. Oh, look at that. Big hole. Look at the O-line. That's all on the O-line right there. He didn't even get touched. Look at our O-line stepping up, man. This is the best they've played all, like, this whole dynasty, I feel like. I mean, their defensive line's pretty solid. They're not, like, you know, they're they're not, I, I forgot the rest of the guys' overalls, but obviously that impact guy has not really done much in this game. All right, good drive. Nine plays, 75 yards. Nice. All right, here we go. Now pressure's on their offense, pressure's on our defense, but I'd rather it be that way than being down and needing to score. Oh, look at that. Nobody blocked him. <laughs> so, yeah, once, guys, once I get the first video uploaded, if we get some, uh, we get some comments on the videos, I'll start, uh, you know, interacting here. Oh, goodness. I probably won't get too far ahead. I'm just recording while I can. And I think what I'm trying to do is just I want to make sure I get all these videos recorded before. Uh, like, I don't want to have, like, a big gap in the middle of the season. You know what I mean? Like, I don't want to I don't want to be uploading, like, three games a week and then all of a sudden, like, not upload for two weeks. So if I record in advance, that allows me to kind of balance out the videos a little bit. So... I mean, I know that doesn't matter that much, but if I know there's some guys following this, and I, shout outs again to you all. Um, 
you know, if you're following this, watching them right when they come out or the day after, or a few days after, whenever. I mean, I want to make sure there's no like, like big gaps in videos. Like I don't want to go like two weeks without posting a new a new game. So that's the only re that's the main the main reason why I'm recording these in advance. Look at this. Kind of fell forward a little bit, but it's third down. So yeah, today it's it's February thirteenth, but the thing is, is I've I've got all these recorded and saved on my hard drive, on my solid state drive actually, but I've got to actually go in and make sure I don't need to. I may have to edit a couple of them, like the first game. I had to. I literally got a phone call in the middle of the first game and had to. I paused the game for like an hour, <laughs> so. I stopped the recording and uh, picked it back up, so I got to edit those parts. But that was a big stop there. That was huge. I'm talking over my play right now because I'm not really having to do much on defense. So we're making plays. We're making plays without Edwards. I'm not really having to do anything. But anyway, uh, I will interact with the comments always. Uh, so yeah, if you guys, I think the first video I asked like who are you guys most excited about on defense, and we've got some guys. I'm calling fair catch on that, in no way. Um, we've got some guys on defense making plays this game. Payne, Travis Payne already has a pick. Um, our linebackers, I feel like, are playing really well. Our linebackers are playing really well this game. Specifically, uh, our middle linebacker, 31. I, I'm blanking on his name right now. Atkins, is that right? I don't even know. Look at Townsend. Get the outside. Get the edge. Nice. At the 41. We got a flag down on the field. Might have been off. They are jumping. And we are taking advantage. Taking full advantage of that. Look at the rushing yards, 278. I remember last season we 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 had one of our best games against Georgia Southern last season. I don't know why. Like they're actually pretty good. But look at this, man. 336. For some reason, we've got their, we've got them on defense. They cannot stop us. I mean, I say that we're only up by eight points, but okay. Look, we threw a, we threw an interception in the end zone, which could have easily been if we didn't throw that, it would have been a field goal. And then we we they stuffed us on the goal line, so it could easily be 31-13 right now. I forgot about that. They got the goal line stand at at the end of the half. And we threw a pick in the end zone on our first drive. So, yeah, it could easily be much, much, much. It could be a three-score game right now. But, you know, it's not. So we got to keep playing. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, no, don't do that. Don't do that. That was bad. I should have just I should have just took the loss there. I tried to throw it out, but he, he hit. I think he hit the O-lineman, honestly. Right, fortunately, when he threw those fumbles... Usually we're right on top of it because it's going near the guy and it's going in the backfield and usually like the O-line or running back can pick it up. I probably lead the league in fumble or lead the conference and in, in the I probably lead the NCAA in fumbles but not in fumbles lost. <laughs> oh, they're blitzing. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. There's nowhere to go. And that'll get this defense fired up. And now we got an O-line injured. Who is that? As an offensive lineman, you gotta I don't know who that is. It's one of the guys on the left side. It's either a tackle or a guard. I'm not sure. Okay, well, as soon as I talk about how we're moving the ball and <laughs> how well their defense can't stop us, they make a stop there and get a big sack. So, All right, we got to be careful here. Uh, I don't want to give up a big punt return. I'm going to kick it higher. He punts it. Cole, that's the outside linebacker. Ah, oh, broke a tackle. All right. I'm gonna take like a five-minute break after this quarter. I I, I need to get a drink of some. I need to get a drink of water or something. I'm so thirsty. <laughs> I should really, if I'm gonna record this early, it's not even that early. But if I'm gonna record, I need to at least like eat some breakfast or drink some water. The voice is getting dry. All right. Going to the fourth, guys. I'll be right back, but I'll probably cut it out. So. All right, I'm back. I had to get some water. I, I need a little break, too, sometimes. I can't. Uh, I've been talking for about an hour, and 
Anyway, fourth quarter. They look like they. Oh, I'm getting stuck. What's going on? Oh, look at that. Nicholas, that's our safety making a play. We got too much speed. You can't run those tosses against us this year. We could not defend that play last year because we didn't have any speed on the on the outside. But yeah, those those aren't going to work this year against our defense. All right, this is good. Third and thirteen. They're in a passing situation. We can spy with Robinson. I'm going to put him on the right side, and I'll kind of hold the edge with Edwards. Although their quarterback's in the zone, and they may. He may try to scramble here. Oh my goodness, what's he doing? I don't know. I couldn't even see where that was going. <laughs> There's Atkins. Yeah, so Atkins, our middle linebacker, making plays. He's had a good game. I don't know. Maybe I'm maybe I'm crazy, but I feel like he's been everywhere and making all kinds of tackles and big plays on defense. We haven't had any turnovers. Or no, we, they, they threw a pick. That's right. Yeah, we got an interception. All right. Um, there we go. Oh, they kick it left. We may have a chance here. There's nobody with us. Let's go, Fox. Redeem yourself. Yes. Nice. I'll take that. 75 yard return. I didn't realize it was that long. <laughs> Oh, I don't even care. Get the get the flag. I don't even care. I think they might have gone just a little too far. Fox redeeming himself after that fumble on the the first punt. So we ran a straight block, and what happened was they shifted their guys in to cover the the punt the the punt rush, whatever that's called. Uh, the pump block attempt, and what happened is he, 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 like, I don't know if he shanked it or just kicked it way right, but, oh my, we almost missed a kicker, come on, man. That was a weak kick. <laughs> uh, anyway, they kicked it, they, they kicked it way right, and there was just nobody, nobody to cover, nobody to cover that side of the field, so. I feel good, 15 point lead, we're feeling good. Just don't, okay, good. Kickoff coverage should be better this year, we've got much more speed. All right, so I really, you know, they're only down two scores. There's plenty of time. They're probably still, I would think they would still run the ball a little bit. Oh, yeah, they're coming out in the um, the slot, whatever this is called. Flexbone slot, trips or something, not trips. Oh, look at that. Our defensive line's playing well, too. I mean, for some reason, we just couldn't stop the pass last game. I don't know why, but our run defense has been solid. We've got second and nine here. And sometimes that's not the case. Like on Heisman mode, it's it's not easy to stop the run. Sometimes you'll just not you'll just get five six yards on you, and they'll just keep running it. They won't stop running it if they get first downs. Oh, he's open. We're there though. Look at their total offense. At their 5.41 season average. That's crazy. We're not giving up that. <laughs> Nobody's giving up. No, we're not giving up 541 yards of total offense on anyone. Maybe last year. We could have easily done it last year. But we also we also control the clock. We control time of possession, so this looks like a first down here. I don't know if can we get there? Oh we can. Nice. Look at the speed. I forget we have so much speed. I decided to take the quarterback because I was more nervous about him making moves and picking up the first down and then that recovery speed. I am surprised they're not going for it. I gotta watch the yeah, I'm calling safe safe coverage here. No, they're gonna punt it. Okay. I guess they trust their defense for some reason. I mean, we're if we pick up a couple first downs, that might end the game. All right, I'm going to. I may run up the middle. Yep, that's a huge hole. Nice. I gotta get Washington going. I mean, he's an important part of the offense this year, obviously. I mean, he he's this, he's technically I mean he's a second string running back, but in you know, in almost all of our formations have two running backs, so we need him. I may do another handoff up the middle here. We'll see. Actually, we'll try to we'll try to read this. It's so hard to read. It's like a split second decision. It's much quicker than the zone read uh, option. 
Early jump. Yeah, just take the take the first down. There we go. Yeah, Brad, this kid is a hard nosed football player. He gives him that kind of effort on every single I'm feeling pretty good about this guys. I was so nervous about this game. I did not want to I mean you know, it's it's okay. Like I I'm not expecting to win a national championship this season. I mean, who knows? I'm not expecting to win a national championship with a D plus overall. <laughs> I mean, you gotta remember, like teams like Utah and Navy are probably still like at least B plus or close to A. Oh, look at this, plenty of space. I'm just gonna die, get on the ground. Yeah, but I mean, I like winning the SEC East is a pretty good goal for this season. So. I think, yeah, I think our goal for this season, let's try to win the SEC. Um, I don't know. Like, we still got a couple more non-conference games coming up in the end of the year, and I don't know how good those teams are. Like, obviously, Hoster really lost to last year, but we got them at home this year. Um, break the tackle. Look at this. McIntyre just getting stronger as the game goes on. Look at that. 200 yards. I don't think we've gotten that many games with 200 yards for him. I mean, as good as he's been, I try to not make him like a like a. I try not to make him a workhorse as much as I can because I want to keep him fresh and healthy the whole season. And I know that may not matter that much, like in the, in this game, but you know, the more carries you get, the better chance you'll have of getting hurt. So they're still drawing him off sides like that. So yeah, good goal for this season. Let's try to win. I mean, assuming we get out of here with a win, unless we unless we blow a game to, you know, I don't. We have to watch Furman though. We got another tough game coming up after this, so it's not gonna be easy. I'm just trying to like let's just think about our goals for this season. Let's let's try to win the SEC. At least try to win the SEC East. We'll have to play in the championship game if we do. Um, but here's the thing. Oh, this might have a chance. I'm just going to take it with Townsend. That's fine. Ah, we got to bounce. It's okay, though. Um, we still got to get past Western Carolina. That's obviously... I, I think I think they're still the best team. Um, I'll have to look at their roster again. Uh, but I tell you what, the, I mean, somehow Wofford is 3-0 and already. We have to look at them because uh, they're also in the East. Ooh, it was, I cut up the middle there. It was close. They're still jumping, my goodness. <laughs> They're playing so aggressive. I'm taking the... I guess I could have took the yards there, but let's let's try to just run the clock. Get an extra play. So, I mean, and, and teams are just going to get better, guys. Like, we're in the SEC. I mean, we're, we're going to recruit good this year, I feel like, but also all these other teams are going to have good recruiting classes, so... Almost got no. Are you kidding? I think he was down. He almost got a touchdown. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he was down there. That that ball came out really late, but I will take first and goal at the one. So that's all right. McIntyre in the zone again. Do we just go ahead and give him? Well, I can't get him in the full. Okay, let's just do. Um, let's just do this. If he wasn't in the zone, I would probably hand it off to. Washington, but let's get him a day. Let's give him four touchdowns. Can we do that? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You guys have got to listen to me. This kid has a sixth sense or something. I can't put my finger on it, but it's like you can smell the end zone. You can smell the end zone. Okay, uh, I think we're going to get this win, guys. What a game. I was worried about this one, yeah, especially being on the road. I mean, you never know with these conference games on the road. But I tell you what, this will be one of our toughest games of the season, so we get this win, at least in conference. Northern Illinois was ranked number seven, but we, we got out of there with a win. So we're now 2-0 and against the top 25, this season at least. We lost to West Carolina last season. But yeah, what I was saying is like, so you got these, we, we're in the SEC, so the thing about this is, and what I really do like, is that as we are getting better, and as we're getting better recruits, all these other teams are going to be getting better recruits. Um, 
Like, I know, there's a, oh, come on, dude. Hit him in the face. Um, like, there's going to be five-star recruits going to all these other schools. Maybe not all of them, but, like, I know for a fact that I think, okay, so remember, if you guys remember last year, I'm going to try to talk while I'm stopping them on defense. Give me one second here. They're throwing. I got to pay attention. Oh, he's running. Nice. Who is that? That's Cole. It's outside linebacker. Nice. Sent him on the blitz, and he got to the edge. Perfect. So I think we're good. Third and, th third and 16. Um, but you guys remember, so last year, last season, there was a it – was It's you may not remember it unless you, you know, <laughs> it's okay. I'll just tell you. Um, in in-season recruiting, there was a five-star running back we were going after. I'm going for the blitz with Edwards. <laughs> um there was a five-star running back that we were going after. I forgot his name. I'm blanking on the name, but I, he committed. I think he committed to Furman. If I don't remember, I think it's Furman, and we play them next week. I can't remember his name, but he was a five-star running back, and he went to Furman, I think. So I mean, look at the block. I'm gonna try to throw a block there. Um, so like these guys, what I'm saying is these other teams are also getting five star recruits. So as we're getting better, other teams are still getting better. So we're it's not gonna be a cakewalk. I mean we're <laughs> it's gonna be a tough. Every game's gonna be tough. I mean we're gonna have to come out and play. I gotta flip this the other way. I'm just gonna hand it off to James. I don't want um I just wanna try to run the clock out here. But yeah, um, I mean, we we'll have to be careful. We got, I mean, just because these teams are have poor ratings still. I mean, our ratings are deep less, so I mean, we're it's not like we're light years ahead of everyone. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to come out and play. Uh, and I'm hoping recruiting. I'm excited for recruiting this season because it looks like, you know, we're already two and oh, we're already miles ahead of last season. We're two and zero oh in non-conference. I'm gonna call. I'm gonna. Can I get McIntyre a catching a receiving touchdown? Wouldn't it be crazy? <laughs> I call time. I don't know if I feel about. I don't know if I feel good about this. I'm gonna try it. Let's just try it. Oh, they come out. Are you kidding me? Oh no, they're blitzing. Ah, it's okay. I was gonna try that pass, but I. Yeah, let's just hand it off. That didn't really work. I was going to try that pass, but no, that was stupid. <laughs> um, should I try this one? This is what happens when you make plays. You end up being named Coke Player of the Game. Congratulations. 21 carries, 205 yards. Now nah, let's just run it. Um, I'm just kind of teasing around. <laughs> you got to keep it interesting. Oh, that almost worked. Uh, do we? Yeah, just punt it. I like to keep him at 13 points. That's a pretty good defensive performance. Snyder is back deep to return. He punts it. I could have let that go a little more. That's okay. All right, 44 seconds. Let's just let them run a few more plays. No touchdowns here. They'll take over at the 13-yard line. Oh man, I gotta go to the gym after this. I've been sitting down all day. It's a Saturday. It's raining. There's nothing really to do. I'm gonna try to run to the gym. They line up at the 21. We've got a second and two. Yeah, guys, so I'm going to come back and look for comments on all these videos, but oh, look at this guy. Now he's making plays. I'm interested, again, who are you guys most excited about on defense? Our linebacker, I mean, by now, if you're following the series, we've got, uh, I'll try to give you guys a rundown quickly. Uh, so right there, number six, Travis Payne, cornerback. He's got a pick already in this game. Uh, obviously, the guy I'm using all season is going to be Edwards, the strong safety on the opposite side. That's probably offsides. Yeah, it's offsides. Uh, Jackson right there is our, is our corner on the other side. He was an in-season recruit. Uh, 28 on the screen just a second ago is Nicholas. He's another strong safety. I think he's got uh, – yeah, it was offsides. <laughs> he's already got three picks, I think. Is that right? 
Or no, he's got two. Edwards has three, I think. I got three picks with Edwards already. Thomas Robinson right there. Number 40 is our five-star Juco recruit. Um, and then we've got Atkins, the middle linebacker. Oh, my goodness. They're going deep. Atkins, the middle linebacker. Cole, outside linebacker on the other side, number 47. And then defensive line, you know, I need to actually go over my defensive line. I know um, – We'll just call the defensive line as a unit right now because uh, they it's going to be hard for them to, like, make huge plays because none of them are, like, I don't even think I don't even think any of them are over 70 overall. So we got, what, 52, 91, and 99. Um, I'll try to go over them later on. I don't actually remember <laughs> which is which, to be honest. Um, all right, last play of the game here. I don't really know what play they're going to call. I thought they would do a Hail Mary, but it doesn't look like it. Oh, this is a handoff. Okay. That's one of our defensive linemen. Who is that? I can't tell. They put him... I don't know. That's all right. Anyway, good win today. What a good win. We're 1-0 now in conference. 3-0 on the season. That's nice. That's nice to see. But I was really impressed the way this game was won. The Citadel. Came out here very focused, and they took care of... My dog's been laying here the whole game with me, so now I'm just... That'll do it for this broadcast. Of NBA <laughs> like rubbing on his belly. Oh, he loves it. Count in this one, the Citadel, 35, Georgia Southern, oh. 13. All right. McIntyre played the game, obviously. I don't even know. What did he finish with? Four touchdowns? We'll check it here in a second. Um, 399 total offense. We controlled them um, pretty much the whole game. They scored an easy opening touchdown. Uh, but our, I mean, we were good. Only 217 on total offense. Held in the 3 of 10 on third down. They never got to the red zone. Wow. I didn't realize that. That I guess that the, their touchdowns were both pretty long passes. Or what was their first? I forgot their first touchdown. Was that a run? I don't remember. Uh, McIntyre, 21 carries. So he only got 21. That's not bad. I, I like to keep him under 25. Uh, preferably around 20, which that's pretty good. Four touchdowns. <laughs> Seven broken tackles. Did have one fumble. That's okay. Uh, Townsend and Washington, again, they're just doing what I need to do. Not crazy on the averages, but 11 carries for Washington. No fumbles for him. That's good. Uh, Jackson only out for the game, so that's nice to have him back. McIntyre, 41 receiving yards, too. All right, here we go. Uh, look at the – got some tackles for loss here. Corey Cole. Corey Cole played a good game. Okay, so both of our other linebackers. Robinson only had two tackles, but, he, I mean, he played a solid game. I think he had a pass breakup. Cole with a sack. Travis Payne with the interception. Yeah, Edwards and Robinson both with pass deflections. We didn't really do a whole lot on defense, but we held them, held them to only 217 on offense, so it was a pretty good game. Yeah, okay, they did have one rushing touchdown. That's right. All right, guys, it looks like once we save and simulate this week, we're going to be ranked. It's going to be our first national ranking. So what do you think we'll be here? We were 26. I mean, obviously, it depends on how many other teams lost, but I'd say we'd be anywhere from – I mean, we'll probably be anywhere from 20 to 25. I'm thinking, like, honestly, it may only be, like, 23. We'll find out. Furman three and zero, and Wofford is three and zero. So we got we got tough games coming up. I mean, we're not we're not cruising at whatsoever. All right, let's advance week. Let's see what we are. Twenty three. Okay, we are. We got the ranking on our name now. Let's check recruiting here. Let's see. Does anybody go up after that? This guy's still way ahead. This five-star corner, man. That'd be a huge pickup. Uh, defensive tackle from South Carolina. That'd be nice. Uh, we actually got some guys from South Carolina that are actually interested, which is which is nice. I like to see that. Uh, this receiver is way ahead. Uh, this guy's from Georgia, but he's we're pretty far ahead. Uh, Tennessee State's coming up in second. Uh, we're tied with Western Carolina on that guy. Uh, and then we really need this guy, man. We really got to get him up. 
I mean, he's Jacksonville State still in the lead, but we're right there behind them. I really need. I would love to get him, unless we, unless somehow we can get a scrambling quarterback in the offseason recruiting. But that's a little, that's a little risky. I'd like to try to get him in the in season recruiting, just because if you you can guarantee an interest and in target if you target them. Um, so let's see where are we at here. Uh, Hawaii. Towson is up number thirteen. Now we're then on the way back up to fourteen. Tennessee State's twenty-one. Ohio. There we are. Twenty-three. Rank number twenty-three. It's good to see. Uh let's look. Fort Atlantic FIU in there. Uh so what do we got? Western Carolina's receiving votes. Georgia Southern's right behind them. McIntyre and the Heisman? No. I don't know if I won Heisman. I mean, it's... these other. I feel like these other teams are going to put up such better numbers going against, against this competition. But we did get Player of the Week, though. It's good to see. That's first time Player of the Week for this season. Yep. 3-0, 1-0 in conference. And look at Wofford. Well, I'm surprised Wofford's 3-0. All right, check. No suspensions. Um, let's check real quick. Um, we've got Furman next game. Oh, look at this. They got a five-star quarterback. 80 overall. And he's got a really good throw accuracy and really good throw power. That's going to be a problem. He's not very tall. He's only 5'11". Oh, here we go. Look at the. He's not even starting. That guy. That's the guy. That's the guy we we targeted and missed out on in season recruiting, and he's not even starting. <laughs> Are you kidding? <laughs> well, they got a good. Uh, the receivers actually aren't that great. That guy's got good speed, but. All right, they're we're gonna have to watch their quarterback and running back. They're, and even yeah, the other guy. They'll probably line him up at wide receiver. I bet their offensive line. Goodness. Okay, their tackles are not good at all. So we can. We can try to blitz the edges. Uh, defense, defensive lines okay. Uh, they got a good linebacker. I mean, 68 overall. That's not great, but it's solid. Uh, they got a good outside linebacker. Corners are not great. They got one good corner. They do have good free safeties. Interesting. Well, this will be interesting. Um, we're just gonna have to. Go. It's a road game, so I never, I never know what to expect in these road games. But we'll come out and see what happens and. Guys, I'll see you next video. Peace.